So tell me, Bobby, what exactly is the article about? The kidnapping of an American citizen. You think I had something to do with this kidnapping? I'm not the one you have to convince. I only ask that you please listen to the whole story. Looks can be deceiving. I am a lover of America, although I was raised to feel very Pakistani. I left to go west, where I was welcomed with open arms. You have 20 minutes to convince me that you belong at Underwood's Hanson. In America, I get an equal chance to win. And whether or not you hire me, Jim, I am going to win. Good answer. Congratulations. Your expression was amazing. I was living the American dream. Woo! You have a gift for this. A very lucrative gift. You picked a side after 9-11? I didn't have to. It was picked for me. Step over here, sir. So is there a problem? He's an employee. Follow me, please. I watched as American patriotism took on different forms. Have you ever been a member of a terrorist organization? How do you feel about the United States of America? Agent Ford, I love the United States of America. <laughs> Violence had wormed its way into my life. <laughs> what is soft inside you falls away. What is hard? becomes harder. You go down to that office and you do the job you were hired to do! If you're just an innocent bystander, Chung is, why were you hiding? You say guilty people hide? So do people who feel hunted. When you determine where you stand, the color will return to your world. I was living my dream, the American dream. Is there a Pakistani dream? One that doesn't involve emigrating. You teach a course in violent revolution. Your lectures are full of anti-American rhetoric. Your candor is appreciated, Bobby. But your conclusions are wrong. You're playing a dangerous game, Chungus. That extraction team comes in here, all hell's gonna break loose, and you know. You think all these young men are just gonna stand idly by? You're gonna get us both killed. We can stop this right now. Hold it off! Yes, I'm Pakistani. Yes, I'm Muslim.